Hello Brilliance community. Today we are embarking on a thrilling, yet vital journey. We are diving deep into the tantalizing world of sugar and unraveling a secret that could be a life changer. We'll unveil what exactly happens to your body when you quit sugar for a solid month. Can you imagine a month without the sugary delight? It might sound tough, even impossible to some of you. But the rewards that this sweet sacrifice yields could astound you. So, what's the twist in this tale of sugar versus health? Well, that's a secret we'll reveal at the end. Stick with us till the final reveal, you won't see it coming. Let's start by understanding what sugar does to our bodies. Sugar, while providing a momentary delight to our taste buds, is a stealthy intruder. It lurks in almost everything we eat, from our morning cereals to the pasta we love. When consumed excessively, it can lead to an array of health issues such as obesity, heart diseases, diabetes, and even mood disorders. It's a silent disruptor, toying with our health one spoon at a time. Now, visualize yourself deciding to quit sugar for an entire month. The first few days are rough. Your body is used to its daily sugar fix, and when you deprive it of that, it reacts. Your cravings might skyrocket, you might feel irritable, and some of you might even experience withdrawal symptoms. It's your body's way of protesting, akin to a toddler throwing a tantrum for a toy. But wait, don't lose hope yet. After the initial rocky week, the tide starts to turn. As your body gradually adapts to the absence of sugar, something remarkable begins to happen. Your energy levels start to stabilize. No more random afternoon crashes or an unshakable sense of lethargy. You're not constantly looking for an energy pick-me-up because your body starts to derive energy from healthier sources. As you step into the second week of this sugar-free experiment, your heart begins to thank you. It's a well-known fact that excessive sugar intake can lead to heart diseases. Now, without its sweet tormentor, your heart starts to regain its health. Your blood pressure starts to normalize, your cholesterol levels begin to improve, and your entire cardiovascular system experiences a sigh of relief. Now, let's talk about something we all care about, our skin. By the third week without sugar, your skin starts to feel the positive impact. When you consume sugar, it latches onto proteins in your bloodstream, creating harmful molecules called advanced glycation end products or ages. These can cause your skin to lose its elasticity and glow. But now that you've kicked sugar out, your skin begins to rejuvenate. It breathes, it heals, and its natural glow begins to resurface. As we reach the final week of your sugar-free month, it's time to witness the brain-boosting benefits. Your cognitive functions improve, mood swings decrease, and you might notice your memory sharpening. Not just that, but the cherry on top. The scale might give you a pleasant surprise as well. Dropping sugar often leads to weight loss, an added incentive for many. So, at the end of a month without sugar, your body has undergone a health revolution of sorts, from improved cardiovascular health to radiant skin, to enhanced brain function. You've weathered the storm of withdrawal, battled cravings, and emerged victorious. But what's that cliffhanger we spoke about? Here's the big reveal. Once your body has savored the sugar-free life, reintroducing sugar could lead to discomfort. Symptoms like bloating, headaches, or mood swings might return. So, is the momentary sweetness really worth it? That's something to chew on until we meet again in our next video. Remember, the path to brilliance often requires us to make tough but rewarding choices. Stay healthy, stay brilliant.